My name is Veronica Blair. I'm an aerial artist, and here I'm working on a piece called Thank You Forgiveness, or Forgiveness Thank You. I haven't decided yet. Uh, it's mostly a piece about unpacking trauma and deep healing uh, that I created for the 2018 San Francisco Aerial Arts Festival. I began work on this project in winter of 2018 um, after a conversation that I had with Joanna Highgood um, of Zacco Dance Theater. Uh, she basically called me up and asked me what I would create if I had a warehouse space available to create in. And I would create a piece about wherever I am in life right now, which is I'm healing from a lot of past events and deep trauma. And I think I would want to use an aerial silks because it's a warehouse and I need something to fill the space. Here in this process, I'm working on the third iteration of the piece, working mostly with suitcases uh, that represent literal baggage that uh, a person could carry with them. They hold secrets to my past, secrets to forgiveness, secrets to letting go, secrets to evolving. And it is through that process of like exploring what's deep inside of the suitcases, what's inside of the baggage, uh, where I find, where my character finds freedom. I was inspired by Erica Badu's song, um, Bag Lady, which is like a neo-soul classic. But then I realized that it was, that I would have to dig a little bit deeper than just playing a neo-soul track, like a song, and just performing to it. I got to go to Seoul, Korea and present my act in front of the Seoul Museum of Art. I think it was also at that point that I realized that the, the piece would be ever evolving. Like there was, would never really be a set way to perform the act that like every single time that I performed it, I could actually have a different experience and that I could interpret my own work in different ways every single time like every single time there could be a new experience my character shifted in a way that highlighted being extremely uncomfortable in public spaces that performance was more about how to handle that pressure social pressure and how to be okay with myself and it requires a lot of confidence that honestly I've had to build through the process of creating this piece. And you need to be okay with being in the present moment. In some way, I hope that the people watching will be healed in some kind of way.